Hey friends! I'm back with another What's For Dinner collaboration. This video is an autumn dinners theme. And so for this video, I'm going to do a full meal for you guys with kind of an autumn twist. As I mentioned, it is a collaboration, and so I'm going to be posting a link in my description box to a playlist. So when you're done watching my video, you can check that playlist out and see what all of my YouTube friends have come up with for their autumn dinners. If you're new to my channel, hi there, my name is Desiree, aka Mama Friendly, and I do hauls, vlogs, all sorts of stuff really. I'm a stay-at-home homeschooling mama to a special little boy and well this is my life. Part of my life is that I eat dairy-free keto and even on days that I'm not so keto and go a little higher carb I am always gluten-free and dairy-free. So for this meal I made a pumpkin chili that is touted as keto but I feel more comfortable calling it low carb. It's got about 26 net grams of carbs per serving and that's pretty much what I eat in a whole day. So I don't know if I'd call that keto but it's definitely a low carb delicious hearty chili that was just for kind of a side with it, I took a recipe that I found online for a coconut flour cake and I tweaked it a little bit to make it sort of like a cornbread, if you will. You can't go wrong with chili and cornbread. And that recipe is definitely keto. Finally, for dessert, I'm gonna make some no-bake snowball cookies. It's extremely easy to put together. The kiddos can help do this. They're so much fun. They're really, really yummy. And each little treat is just one carb. As usual, whenever I find a recipe online, even though I usually end up tweaking them to some degree, I always post links to those original recipes in the description so that if you want to follow along my way, you can just check out the instructions I post on the screen, or if you want to check out the original recipe and try it that way, you're more than welcome to do it. Plus, I always like to give credit where it's due, right? So with all that being said, let's check out our awesome, yummy, and easy low-carb dinner.
really good. <laughs> All right, friends, so that's gonna wrap up my autumn dinner recipes. The pumpkin chili was a huge hit. It was nice and smoky and spicy with that little touch of sweetness from the pumpkin. Definitely something that's gonna be in our rotation all season long. The cornbread slash cake was a huge, huge hit. In fact, I've already made it for my family twice more since I recorded it for this video. It's really easy to tweak. You can make it a little sweeter. You can leave out the sweet and make it a little more savory. It's a very versatile recipe if you're willing to experiment. And as far as the snowballs, ketonians and non-ketonians alike can't get enough of these. Luckily, they're so easy to throw together that I always have a batch in the fridge now. And you know what makes them extra delicious is melting some chocolate low carb or otherwise, and drizzling it over the top, and then just a sprinkle of sea salt on top of that. Incredible. It's basically like a keto mounds, not almond joy, mounds. <laughs> Although there's an idea, you could even chop up some almonds and put it between the snowball and the chocolate. The possibilities are endless as long as you're willing to experiment in the kitchen. If you decide to make any of these recipes yourself, please let me know in the comments how they go for you. I'd love to hear how you make them your own. I want to thank all my YouTube friends once again for hosting this collab and inviting me to join. I can't wait to see what everybody else cooks up. Make sure you check out the link in my description so you can find the playlist and see what everybody else has been up to. I want to thank you all so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it and if you did, I hope you'll please give it a big thumbs up. I'd also love it if you would subscribe and click that notification bell because I post at least three times a week and I wouldn't want you to miss a minute. Thanks so much again for watching. Bye!